Hello and welcome to another episode of This Old Wasteland House. We're at the Green Top Nursery. We're going to have kind of a short episode. We're just mainly going to get this kind of self-sufficient. Uh, I already sent somebody as a supply line to Castle. So we have access to all of our inventories. So we're just going to put enough here to call some people. Oops, wrong button. And generally make it all right. It'll probably get a little bit better as as it goes. But right now... We're just going to throw up a generator, get us a beacon. Actually, we're going to build a big generator. Yeah. And then we're going to throw down a radio beacon. And we're also going to throw down a turret. Because this place needs some serious help. Uh, it had zero defense. I pretty much came here, just dropped it off, and took it like that. So let's go ahead and connect these two things. Give them some defense. Give them some uh, more people coming in. And that'll help us get some more defense as well as production going. But this is enough defense to where this place is happy. And that's about that. We, I am going to build a scavenging station so that way when more people get here... They can do stuff. They can go and collect junk for me. Scavenging station right next to the... Chemistry station. Also, we're going to throw down some more beds. Because we're going to need to. So, we did get some good wood out of here. That's good. We'll be able to uh, make some beds, even though this all, all this takes is steel and cloth. I'm going to put... Probably three beds in here. I don't want to run out of beds just because a bunch of people decided they were going to move in. Yeah, right. No, uh, uh, right. On the ground. There we go. Right there. Three beds in there. We'll put an extra bed in here. And do we have another? Yes, we do. A couple beds in here. Grab these pots. Carpet's fine. Let's add another bed. One more bed. Get eight beds. And then we will uh, add some entertainment and things for them to do in the house. True! Let us add a tiny generator. Okay. Can we pop it on top of the roof? I don't think we can. We'll see. We'll just see if we can pop a tiny generator up. I don't want a big one. Just want a small one. Yeah, we can. Pop that right there. Then we will add some lights. Favorite type of light. That one there. Put this one there. There. Be enough for in here. Let's also add. Got the potted plants and stuff, of course. All decorations. Got our light boxes in our terminal. Where did the TV go? Bloody forgot where the TV went. Miniature. Genius. Counter. Yeah, TV. Television. All right, this is one of the cheaper. We'll pop this TV down, just kind of right over. After we cannot scrap that stuff, we can scrap that though. Lovely little television for them to entertain with, and we'll add a couch for them to sit on and watch it. Use our steel because we still have a lot of steel, not quite as much. The way of other stuff. Turn this chair a little bit. Match up this couch to go with it. Yo, well, let's add some circuitry for our junk. Might have to run this inside the house. I don't know if I can get. Let's build a little ladder real quick. 
Our standard get up on top of junk ladder. There's our generic get up on top of stuff. See what we can do up here. Get our connector. Yay, we can put stuff up. We can add a connector. Oop. A connector there. One right there. And we will see how that does. Why you know like that? Because it's just in the way of stuff? Let's see. Come here, connector. I don't even know how I can reach you now. Lame. We grab it from outside or inside? We've become um, we have become unable to grab our connector. Damn. Makes me sad. Well, it looks like we're just gonna have to give people frickin' poisoning. Drop that right there. I wish I could get those connectors back though. Copper. Come on, boys, it's copper. Give it back. I hit E2. Yay. Got it back. Did I pick it up? No, I didn't pick it up. I just built a note. Damn one. <laughs> Let's try it this way. Try it this way. Red line, red line. Nothing. Alright, so since that doesn't want to work, let's try. We just bring it inside. If we can't, then we'll just pop it outside. And. Nope. Not letting us go through the prefab walls is pretty much the story of this scenario so we'll have to go outside or bring that connector outside and then hopefully it will power most of the stuff from out here so let's grab this probably put this right here and then we'll put our generator inside this little hut and we'll move those beds into different area because nobody wants to sleep next to a generator. Where can we put the bed? There. Sleep with there. They brought our. You come and sleep. Over here. Go. Probably could have gotten rid of those beds, but you know. There we go. Got some power. Obviously, we're just gonna probably get rid of this light. Not that far. You can put this one outside. It doesn't even reach outside. How do you not reach that? You guys have to be touching the same wall? Okay, I don't... Maybe it, the generator ran out of power? We'll store it for now. Generator right there. There. We got some stuff. Alright, let's add a guard post since there are more people strolling up in here. Defenses, guard post. Help keep a lookout. Then you go do that. Got it. Got it. I also want to take this extra person. Standing here doing nothing. Ish. Taking care of a couple of those plants. Probably somebody that was picking up slack. You're already taking care of plants. Let's put you on scavenging duty. You really just pull out your gun and then go sit down, you lazy bastard. There. I have somebody assigned to scavenging. Yay. Awesome. 
Well, as you can see, some odd things happen with interactions with electricity. It's really just a try and uh, try it and see what happens. Sadly, it might cost you some materials, and uh, you might not be able to get them back. So save your game beforehand, try some stuff out. If it does work, great. If it doesn't, you can always load your game up again. I tend not to do that because I like to just roll with it and have fun. So, as you can see, our happiness and stuff's doing well here. We got five people, eight beds, enough water and defense to cover it all. And so it's going to storm. And on that note, I will go ahead and end this episode. Thank you very much for joining me, and as always, stay tuned for more. Uh, I'll be looking at uh, other things to also fill in the, the YouTube of uh, content, so let me know what other uh, Fallout-related videos you're looking for, because, you know, it's going to run into a problem at some point where I'm going to have a tough time finding materials, I would say, like wood and steel after I've wrapped everything in every available, you know, sanctuary pipe place, uh, settlement, there we go, that was what I was looking for, every other settlement, and then it's just a matter of bringing boards back from killing people. So, that's that. I'm also going to stop saying so, so much. Have a good night.